season will be at about 63 by 8 o'clock this morning. 85 by this afternoon for the walk home from the bus stop. It is going to be a gorgeous afternoon and evening. Whether you've got uh, plans maybe to go to an after school practice or a game, maybe a Friday night football game, maybe the state fair, maybe happy hour on the patio. It's going to be gorgeous. These temperatures are going to drop off pretty quickly into the upper 70s for most of those evening hours. Satellite radar this morning shows a quiet picture, but we're actually looking at a chance for some scattered showers and thunderstorms today, mainly across just the northern and eastern portions here of the state. There's a slight chance for that because even though our main storm system from this week has now lifted up into the northern plains, uh, on the back side of this is larger uh, area of low pressure in that trough. There's a little weather disturbance pushing through northern Arizona this morning, and that could help to kick off along with all the moisture still in our atmosphere. A few scattered showers along the rim in eastern Arizona. Most of the state, including the deserts of the state, going to stay dry today. Over the weekend, a storm system pushes into California. That'll bring us just some cloud cover here in the in uh, Arizona. I think in the valley, that'll keep us below that 90 degree mark. So that's the change now for your weekend forecast. Not going to be quite as hot as we thought it was going to be this weekend, uh, but we're not looking at any more uh, rain or stormy weather here in the valley. Here's what we're looking at to the south. A major hurricane going to make landfall uh, in Mexico unprecedented Patricia at category five status has 200 mile an hour winds and it is expected to continue to stay a category five storm as it moves on shore later today in Mexico, southwestern Mexico. This is right between uh, Manzanillo and Puerto Vallarta. As this moves on shore with heavy rain and strong winds, 200 mile an hour winds again, it's going to bring probably a significant flooding across Mexico. And then it's going to push into Texas, no longer as a hurricane. This will just be remnants of this storm by then, but heavy rain. Here's the thing. They're already seeing heavy rain in Texas this morning. They've been dealing with flooding and heavy rain since Wednesday. So all in all, between now and Sunday, they're looking at the possibility of upwards of 10 inches of rain uh, in this portion of Texas. So uh, hurricane Patricia won't impact us here in Arizona, but we're looking at possibly some uh, 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 big destruction later today in Mexico. I know they're really evacuating a lot of communities and hunkering down uh, for that Category 5 storm, strongest one on record. 58 today, the high in Flagstaff here in Arizona. We're going to have lots of sunshine for your Friday, upper 60s for Prescott, mid-80s today for the Valley. It's pretty close to normal for us for this time of year. Sunny and warmer than yesterday by a couple of degrees. Overnight tonight, clear skies and a low of 65. Your Friday night sunset is at 545. Three-day forecast shows we're going to take it to the upper 80s for the weekend. A few clouds for Sunday, but again, we'll stay dry. Next week, looking dry through at least midweek. Temperatures are going to fluctuate.